Joined by Tuscan head coach Adam Jackson after his women's team snaps Wingate's seven-year, 76-match conference winning streak, 4-3 to three this afternoon. Coach, it was a real, the, the emotions, any tennis match is going to have emotions going back and forth, but it seemed like that the pendulum was swinging wildly all afternoon. It was. Um, you know, we swept the doubles, and so it felt like, hey, this is really going our way right now. But, you know, with the new scoring system and everything, it's so important to remember doubles and singles are separate. We try to treat them like two totally different matches. Um, so we had a lot of momentum there. I think it got the ladies really energized. But then, yeah, coming out in singles, um, some tough sets. Annie went in the first set, um, and, you know, hearing her shout it out, um, that really kind of got them fired up again. But at the same time, they were winning two other sets. Um, there were a lot of swings, and, and there were some moments where I didn't know who was going to swing back, you know. Um, but I am just be beside myself proud of the girls, um, of the fight and the grit in these girls. It's amazing. Emily Hansen stepped up today. She uh, won the first set, lost the second set. Seemed like she was teetering a little bit in that second set, and then in the third set, and then just uh, just, just took charge. Yeah, uh, Emily stepped up huge. And you know, we've seen some really good performances from her this year, but for a freshman to kind of step into this role, play high in the lineup, and to fight the way that she did today. Uh, you know, it is hot out here today. This was a long match, three sets, and just to see her kind of stepping up and at every changeover, um, positive body language, you know, holding her head high and, and just looking like she knew she could win. It goes a long way, and in the end, she did it. It's awesome. And of course, in the end, it was Julia Lopez got the got the final point. She first set kind of could have gone either way. She lost that. She fought back, won the second set. And then that third set, it was just a battle of wills. It was, and I told her that. I said, listen, you know, at the set break, uh, we both took a restroom break, and I just told her, I said, you know, I'm proud of you for what you've done already, and I'm going to love you no matter what happens in the set. You know, uh, if we lose at 6-0, we win at 6-0. We're going to wake up and start fighting tomorrow and grinding tomorrow. But um, I am just so impressed, you know, for, for two years, Cooley has kind of been building to this moment and we've been working our way this forward and, and she has stepped up this year. She's been playing four and winning and just has really taken on a role with the team that uh, is invaluable. And I mean, today, yeah, the third set, uh, you could feel the tension in the air. I mean, I was even just trying to kind of lighten the mood a little bit at some of the changeovers, uh, but just so incredibly proud of her for what she did. Obviously, Wingate's the gold standard in the South Atlantic Conference. There's no disputing that. Yes. Um, this is a team they're probably going to see again. It's a team that's probably going to, if you see them again, it's probably going to be 4-3 again. Sure. Um, but but to, to get the upper hand today, uh, you know, especially uh, since it's, since they've been in control of the conference for so long, has just got to be a real feather in the cap of this program. Yeah, it's huge. And, you know, it gives you a lot of confidence going into the tournament, feeling like you can beat anybody, you know. Uh, and I have to say, you know, what Coach Cabana's done there and the streak that those girls have been on. And, you know, it's, they have been the team to beat ever since I came into this conference. And I think we've given them some great runs, but have never come out on top, you know, in the regular season until now. So, um, they are the standard, um, and, and it will be that way even when we go to the tournament. You know, it's uh, I think that everybody knows that we're a good team. Uh, they're a good team. You know, there's a couple other really strong teams in the conference. Um, the SAC overall is just it's very different than it was four years ago. Um, I think we're really coming up, and uh, and it's awesome. It's good for everybody, and yeah, they're a very good team. The last time Wingate lost a conference regular season match was on this very court seven years ago uh, at 4-3, to three, or obviously it was 5-4 to four back then to Wingate. Tusculum winning back in 2012. Today it's 4-3 to three Pioneers. With head coach Adam Jackson, for more on today's match, visit TusculumPioneers.com.